Titans clash with two new blockbuster toy tie-ins, He-Man gets a new best friend, and Tony Stark tinkers around with some new technology in his workshop. This is Articulation Times. Welcome to Articulation Times, your source for action figure news. Today is December 7th, and here are your top stories. The classic film Clash of the Titans gets a big-budget remake next year. Here's your first look at some of the early merchandise from the film. The film's hero Perseus, played by Sam Worthington, will get a 7-inch figure from NECA. He comes in normal form, as seen here, and a battle damage variant. He'll come with a sword and a shield for around 15 bucks in February. The following month, Mezco will release a Mezitz version of the character. He'll run you around $11.99. NECA unveils a new set of Batsu figures for the Street Fighter video game series. These 5-inch figures of Ryu, Blanca, and E. Honda feature articulation on the neck and shoulders. They throw down in February. Mario and the rest of his pals from the Mushroom Kingdom get the action figure treatment. These 6-inch video game characters are based off the classic NES designs. Pick up Mario, Luigi, Yoshi, Toad, and Donkey Kong later this month. Relive the Season 2 finale of Dexter with this 2-pack from Biff Bang Pal. Dexter features a cloth apron and scrubs along with a handsaw and welder's mask. Sergeant Dokes is ready for action too with his handgun and holster. The set also includes a diorama base and background. They release in March for $32.99. MaddieCollector.com has just announced the first Beast figure in the Masters of the Universe line. Battle Cat will come with removable armor and helmet, a saddle that holds the Sword of Power, and most of the figures in the line will be able to ride them, including He-Man. It will go on sale Monday, February 15th, exclusively on MaddieCollector.com. Art Asylum and Diamond Select Toys bring another Marvel Select figure to the line. This time it's Cyclops, in both his regular and X-Factor styles. He'll be packaged with an environmental base. He'll sell for around 20 bucks in the second quarter of 2010. And finally, Hot Toys has just announced its next Iron Man-themed figure. This time it's Robert Downey Jr. as Tony Stark, testing out his new mech technology from Iron Man 1. He stands 12 inches tall, features 34 points of articulation, has two pairs of interchangeable hand palms, an LED lighted heart device, hand gauntlet and boots, an articulated mechanical robot with a 360 degree rotated base, and a cardboard backdrop of his workshop. Look for him in the first quarter of 2010. That's it this week for Articulation Times, your source for action figure news. Be sure to check back on the website for new updates or subscribe to our YouTube channel. As always, be sure to rate us and leave some feedback. Also, you can follow Articulation Times on Twitter and Facebook. For Articulation Times, I'm John Airy. Keep collecting!